Hey guys, I thought I'd give you a two-week update on the reflux treatment for bryopsis in my frag tank. As you can see, it's pretty much melted away. There's still some little pieces left that are white. There's been no harm done to Mr. Damselfish. He is fine in there. I uh, feed him every day, make sure he's good. And uh, it'd be nice to get this tank back hooked up to the system. Uh, snails are fine. You know, everything that's in there is okay. And the bryopsis is definitely dying away. There is some odd uh, slimy kind of coating across the bottom of the tank. But I am not skimming. So that could be part of the issue. You can see here there's a piece of dragon's breath macroalgae. And that's fine. That hasn't it may have even colored up a little more, probably because there's more free phosphates in the water now with all the bryopsis dying. But if you look in the back, I haven't done any removal, so there is some white traces of the bryopsis. And uh, this is places where the cleanup crew really can't get, like the emerald crabs can walk along the egg crate and really take care of it. So I may get in there and do some manual removal. And I may or may not retreat, meaning treat again. And there's a little bit of weird algae going on over at the end of the tank there. But as you can see, all the SPS is good. I did have a couple of issues, but I'll get to that in a minute. So there's some more of the swaying dead bryopsis on the back glass. But by taking pictures every day and coming home late from work, once I left the bright lights on because I turned the whites up to take the picture and then I turned the lights back off and the next day the lights came on and ran a full cycle with a lot of white and that's what happened to these Montiporas I believe. Also, not being hooked up to the system, it's not getting dosed properly. Look at that little starfish even on there. And he's fine. So it hasn't been being dosed, uh, alkalinity and calcium, but I have been topping it off with uh, calcwasser in the water, try and maintain it, and I'm not the best at dosing. And here's a look at what it was like before I started the treatment. So it's definitely working, but there's still some problem areas, and I'm not sure if it's because it's not getting the proper light on those areas, or there was just so much on the glass that I need to manually remove the white. But it would be nice to get the system, like I said, tied back in to the main system. But it's a lot better than that. So, thanks for watching. We'll keep it short. And I'll give you another update in about a week on how it all worked out.